Hi guys, I'm Joanne at Archie and Cat, and today I'm going to be looking at doing um, your own DIY comic strip shoes. So basically, I've got these shoes off of um, eBay, and they're second hand. Um, just look for some white ones that aren't too dirty. Uh, these were much dirtier than they are. I've given them a real good clean, and I think they've come up good enough to be able to do this. So you, you definitely need the white ones because what I'm going to do is uh, get some transfer paper and print. Well, you can print basically anything you want onto transfer paper, but I'm doing comics today. Um, so I've got the white transfer paper, which goes onto white backgrounds, and I've got basically printed off some comic stuff. This is like um, Infinity Wars, Marvel Infinity Wars, this one, Avengers. Um, except that's quite a good one, it's got like practically every character you've got on it. Um, and then, so I'm going to do like one Marvel shoe and one DC shoe just to mix things up a bit because I'm not really into just Marvel, I'm not into just uh, DC, I like, I like them all. And then, yeah, so then I'm just going to basically cut out, cut out the pictures and line them on. Really simple. Alright, so I've got my shoe and I've just stuffed it a little bit to try and pad it out a little bit. I've cut out one of the pieces of transfer paper, the pictures. Um, I've peeled it off of this, the back backing paper. And what you get is this like flimsy transfer stuff. So I've cut the bottom line to, to where I want it to be. And then you need to use this paper to iron it on. That's basically just what I'm going to do. And try and get it in the right place and then iron it on. Right, so I'm just going to get on with doing the rest of the shoe. Okay, so I'm uh, I'm just working my way around, putting big pieces on first and then just filling little gaps in here and there. Little gaps like this, for example, I can just stick a couple of these little strips on just to cover them up. Okay, so I've almost finished. I'm just um, picking these little bits off round the um, holes, the shoelace holes. So basically, you just run your nail across it because those bits are not going to stick. Just pick them off. Same around this edge. If uh, if there's any bits sticking out, just run your finger over it and just you know just pick at it. Got a tiny bit of a white patch there, so I need to fill that in with something. Um, I've overlapped it quite a bit. That's what's good about this white, this transfer paper that goes on white. You can overlap it. It's pretty much see-through. So you just, yeah. But you do have to be careful about what you're overlapping. So that's what we've got so far. I've got another little bit here to do. That's one. I'm gonna do the other one in marble. Okay, so that's the second one done now. So this has got a mixture of the Marvel characters, all sort of from Avengers, Infinity. There's a mixture basically. So you've got Guardians of the Galaxy, Black Widow, Captain America, Thor, Spider-Man, Black Panther, and Scarlet Witch, Captain Marvel, Doctor Strange. That's Black Widow again. Um, Drax. See, that was quite a dark one. And then this sort of uh, space combination one that's got quite a few different characters, but mainly Thor there, you can see. Uh, Iron Man. Okay, so they're uh, finished now. I think they look pretty cool. I'm quite liking this one. Maybe because I like Wonder Woman. You have to let me know what you think. Uh, just be careful with the iron because obviously you can um, burn yourself so this really does require an adult to do it and even then I have slightly burnt my fingers better than the, better than the white boring train isn't it and you can basically do any pattern you want now I mean I'm thinking about doing a Harry Potter pair or maybe a Lord of the Rings kind of pair but I thought this, I thought this looked pretty effective so I'll be wearing them soon Thanks for watching, hope you liked the video, please comment down below and if you've got any suggestions for things that I could make or do, let me know. Bye!